jewels welcome back oh i haven't posted in a while i'm so sorry about that but first we're gonna mix with that i'm also gonna add some rice cakes in there okay today i want it super creamy so i'm not gonna drain the noodles i'm gonna let all the water dissolve it's so delicious that way I used to think that I need to add like extra gochujang, but I recently did it without it. Still, perfect amount of sauce. I don't need to add any more sauces. I have to add the cheese. I'm literally done with all my cheese right now. My last video was two months ago on this channel, but I'm back. This is water. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I used to drink zero coke every day. I'm giving myself a break every other day, so zero coke water, zero coke water. It's working so far. What helps is getting a water bottle and putting ice in there. I love ice water. I recently transitioned my main channel, the Julie channel, into basically what i've been doing on this channel which is lifestyle and luckily i would say it's a pretty successful transition it was really scary like i still feel like i'm in it like the transition but i just want to give a shout out to you guys because i got a lot of practice on this channel oh my god it's so yummy it tastes like i put milk in here but i swear i didn't you guys need to use this recipe when cooking Yeah, now that I'm doing lifestyle content on my main channel, I'm dedicating all those filming for that channel now. Now, I don't know what to do for this channel, which is kind of scary. But I'm going to use it as an opportunity to explore my other interests. If you guys didn't know, like when I first came onto YouTube, starting my audience, I was making fashion content. And I think I'm going to circle around eventually back to fashion, which is like, a challenge for me like it's not easy if i ended up like anna wintour i would be like super happy which is literally snoring right there so even though i'm comfortable with the jilly channel becoming a lifestyle channel i've been really uncomfortable about what to do on this channel now so that's been my dilemma I want to thank Skillshare for sponsoring this video. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of online classes where you can get inspired and learn new skills. I've always wanted to try Skillshare because as a YouTuber who creates, I'm interested in skills like illustration, photography, music, marketing, and even life skills like productivity. After using Skillshare, I could definitely say it's an awesome place to learn skills not only in creative, but in business, self-care, hobbies, and etc. I just love that I could learn it in front of my computer, in the comfort of my own home, and at my own pace. Both of the classes that I took were super organized, easy to follow, and well made. Speaking of classes, I found two that I was immediately drawn to. So my job basically as a YouTuber is personal brands. Basically, I'm promoting myself. So I thought it would be really important that I took advantage of the personal brand classes. I do everything myself, so I definitely wanted a new perspective, especially because I do want to hit 1 million subscribers soon on my Julie channel. So I saw this class called 7 Day Personal Branding Challenge, how to get paid to be who you are. A lot of you guys have asked me how to become a YouTuber or a content creator. Yeah, I think this class is perfect if you just barely started or if you're like me who has been doing this for a while, it's also a really good class, especially because the teacher of this class is the brand manager of adidas so yeah i was so honored to learn from her because she's so young successful not just my class but on skillshare all the classes are taught by super experienced and successful people in 2023 i definitely focused on creating a good environment for myself now that i'm in a good space i feel like in 2024 i definitely want to 
invest in my health, my body. I've recently been interested in adding Pilates to my lifestyle and Skillshare had this course called Complete Pilates Mat Course. I already have a mat that I've been using so I could start this class ASAP. I have actually started Pilates a little bit this year but through this class I learned that I've been doing a bunch of my forms wrong so yeah. I really appreciate this class because I haven't even been doing proper Pilates. If you guys want to explore low impact exercise like Pilates, I would recommend this class. So yeah, those are the classes I enjoyed and if you want to join your own classes, the first 500 people to use my link in the description box will get one month free trial of Skillshare. I'm so excited for my jewels to explore new skills on Skillshare. Thank you so much to Skillshare for sponsoring this video. As we were back from the vet, that was minus $132. And Mochi always gets a cheeseburger after the vet. Ooh, Mochi, a fresh cheeseburger. Wait. Very hot for me. Slow down. By the way, this cheeseburger has no pickles, no ketchup, no mustard, no onions. It's just legit plain flavor with no salt and cheese. Oh, it was next to the camera. Oh, she licked the camera. That's it, Mochi. Your breakfast. Good job. Guys, look at this huge hamburger. What the heck? It's only 200. I thought it would be like 500. This would be a good decoration for Mochi's birthday. This is the theme of her birthday. Wait, can you show how big it is next to me? Okay, one, two, three. Go. We have ramen plushie. Oh. This, this is a piggy bank. Can I take off? Oh, it's not that cute though for $30. It should be only like $15. Yeah. Oh, I like this one. Look at this cat, guys. It's so cute. Even the belt works. Oh, this purse is so pretty. It's actually Hello Kitty. Yay, I went to the mall yesterday. I was looking for some stuff for my birthday. And speaking of my birthday, I already got my first couple of gifts. So at Auntie Anne's, I got that free pretzel because I have the app. And then at Sephora, they were able to give me my birthday gift. If you didn't know, Sephora gives you a birthday gift every year. And so I chose, I chose this because they had like a hair kit and a mascara and then skincare. So I just chose skincare because I always do skincare, but I don't really need mascara nor shampoo. Whoa, this is so nice. Who knows? I might really like them one day, so. And then what I really went to Sephora for was this. 
I haven't bought makeup at Sephora in a long time. And this is my first time ever, ever buying something from the brand Glossier. Or Glossier. How do you pronounce it? Glossier? I saw some girl on TikTok use this. And I want to wear it for my birthday, I think. This is going to be one of my birthday looks. And you guys will see. It's $18. And I... I rarely buy makeup, guys. It's so crazy. That's what I got Sephora. Next, I went to Urban Outfitters because recently... Mochi's chewing on a hanger, by the way. So, please ignore that. But yeah, recently, I've been into... Recently, I've been eyeing Urban Outfitters a lot, like, online. And I thought, I might as well try out their pieces. I, I don't think I bought something from there before. <laughs> I didn't know that we were at the mall so long that it was, like, 15 minutes before closing. And I couldn't even try it on, so I had to try it on, like, in front of a mirror. But, yeah, I didn't have enough time to go throughout the store. But I did find this piece. I tried it on, and I thought it was a shirt, right? Like, a tube top. But it's actually a skirt and extra small so but yeah it was 39 dollars. it was on sale and it's so unique you guys will see me wear it on my birthday for sure it looks so cool i had to get it i don't have anything like this that's all i got i wish i like got more but we went to the mall kind of late to be honest and my mom was also searching for my auntie's birthday gift so yeah, I feel like I had to do another video where I'm going to the mall for the whole day. Cause my mall is like the best mall ever, guys. Because if you didn't, if you didn't know, the biggest mall in the world is the Mall of America in Minnesota. So yeah, that's a, that's one of the things I could flex about living in Minnesota. We have like one of the be better malls. Today I am packing all day. I'm really stressed, guys. Honestly, I have two sponsors lined up, and they're like big ones and. I have to make sure I reach certain deadlines because other people are involved and I have to make sure I do my work. But yeah, and then I have I have to make sure I complete my whole to-do list today. One of the things I want to do is try on the lenses of Piggy Paradise. You guys saw me unbox this, but I finally had the time to pair them. So if you didn't know, like Piggy Paradise, I've been wearing their contact lenses for almost five to seven years i'm not sure somewhere between there but yeah it's where i get my contacts for halloween for daily yeah it's the only place i get my lenses since these are yearly contacts you have to prepare them like eight hours and because they've been in that little tube for, for yearly contacts you have to soak them overnight with contact lens solution so i did that so yeah we're probably gonna try them i'm so excited because they're like new lenses they're all new lenses i haven't tried before and i haven't worn lenses in so long so, so i'm gonna be trying one two three four five and guys they're all in my prescription this time so not only are they like really cool just to have like change your look but they can help me see i'm actually negative two these will really help me see more in hd so i need to wash my hands and prepare a towel i washed my hands I'll write down the names of each lens I try. Okay, these look like daily ones. They're brown. So these, I'm thinking of wear on my actual birthday. So, okay, this is before. Ooh, I got one in. Oh my God, it's so cute and natural. Okay, this is a good natural lens. I'll recommend to you guys. Cause look at how kawaii my eye instantly became. Ooh, that was so easy to put in. Okay, I'm. I think I'm gonna wear these today because they help me see better oh my god I, as i instantly see in hd these are so good guys i recommend it they're just like enlarging brown contact lenses i think i'm gonna wear peaky paradise forever <laughs> i have a coupon code with them it's julie 10 by the way you'll, you'll save 10 percent off so okay next i think these are halloween ones so this is these are huge too the new halloween ones so oh my gosh that is so cool i feel like i'm in an anime whoa Oh my god, this is art on that on a contact lens. Honestly, I can't really see clearly with these, but that's that goes for like all Halloween cost Halloween contacts if you didn't know. Oh uh, my god, these are tense. Oh my goodness. So I did choose my Halloween costume and it matches mochi and I do feel like these might go with them. So that's a hint when my costume is Whoa. Oh my gosh, these are so cool. These are the coolest lenses I ever tried. I don't even really feel real right now. <laughs> this is so cool. These are so cool, but I gotta move on. Maybe I'll be wearing these for Halloween, guys. Oh my god. So I feel like this is another anime lens. It's blue-green one. I feel like I don't really like blue contact lenses on me. It just looks weird, but maybe green will look more natural. Okay, these are how these look. Again, I don't think I look as good in 
blue lenses compared to like pink and brown lenses so but these are a cool option if you're looking for blue lenses for your Halloween costume and next it looks like it's gonna be a natural pair of pink and I like to match my lenses to the case Ooh, these are like lilac purple pink oh I love these the brown one and this one are my favorite boom okay these are probably my second favorite after the brown ones super natural even though it's pink yeah i recommend if you guys are looking for a pink circle lens this one's pretty good it looks purple in the pan but like on my eyes right now it looks pink because my eyes are brown i think okay we're down to the last one it's in a yellow case so i think it might be a halloween one or a natural they're legit blue ones these are really pretty and they look really natural so let's see Boom. I don't feel like I look good in blue lenses, but these are pretty natural. They're not as comfortable as like Olin's or daily lenses, but I've worn these before for like eight hours and it's all right. I just say, I would just say just don't wear them every day. I would say like probably five times a week. These are made to last a year, so they're pretty high duty, heavy duty lenses compared to like daily soft lenses but Peaky Paradise does have daily lenses if that's what you guys are looking for so this is the blue one. Oh, I could wear this if I want to do like a possessed look for Halloween because I don't know why I just look I just look crazy with blue lenses but the quality is there the uniqueness is there and I also enlarged my eyes a bit yeah these are good if you're doing like a possessed zombie look I feel like but yeah I'm gonna go for the brown ones today because I just feel like it just Looks really natural. It makes me pop a little bit more. I'm also going to pack this case for New York. It's the one that Pinky Paradise has. So cute. They have this on there. And they have like a bunch of good size. But I got the peach one. Like I said, I'm really stressed out. And yesterday, I also bought myself this. And I'm too stressed out to go cook. So we're going to eat this for breakfast. This is my first caramel apple of the fall. I'm not sure if it's good. But I got it at Walmart. It's only $1.48. So. And I love green apples. So this is... This is probably going to be delicious. Yeah, I'm going to join my apple and then we're going to park. It's 2 o'clock, so... And I have an appointment at 7, so we're going to... Before my appointment today, I'm going to just pack all day. Mmm! Mmm! I love it. gonna be a one day trip so i'm just gonna pack a carry-on which i'm not doing any check bags today this is gonna go on the overhead and this one i'm debating to bring it can be used as a personal it's like as like the thing that goes under your seat i honestly don't want to carry that much but if i have to i'll bring this just in case or in case i want to bring home some food from new york <laughs>
So I'm back from the buffet. I took a nap and washed off my makeup. I'm back in my pajamas. I already opened this at the restaurant, but oh my gosh, guys, I had so much fun at my birthday lunch. This is my first time actually inviting like, two of my aunties and my uncle and two of my cousins. I mean, I never did that in California. I don't know why. Like, I just always celebrated my immediate family or just like my mom. <sighs> Honestly, guys, I really am happy I came to Minnesota because I really like the family I have over here. I definitely like my mom's side of the family much more. What about you guys? Do you guys like your mom's side more or your dad's side more? My dad's side was a cult, so obviously they were horrible. My mom actually got me these gifts this year. One of the reasons she says she never gave us gifts is because she doesn't know how to wrap. And I was telling her, it's not about the gift wrap. Honestly, this is so cute. I don't care if she's not a professional gift wrapper. Yeah. I don't know why she's so insecure about her wrapping. I think because my cult family, like my dad's family, like makes fun of her wrapping one time. Yeah, shout out to my mom for the gifts. And shout out to my fam. Oh my god, guys, my aunt paid the bill. We were busy cutting cake and I was busy uh, packing the takeaway. And like all of a sudden, the check disappeared, and apparently, my auntie paid for it. Ah! Ta da! She got me the biscuits I really love from Costco. Delicious, guys. Okay, next. Yeah, guys, this is what I did on my actual birthday. I actually felt like I was celebrating. Not just by myself, but like people that I actually care about. And also, I got my new TV, of course. This is like the best pre present I ever got myself. I just want to give a shout out to my jewels who follow me on my spam account. I think it was like three months ago we manifested this TV together. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys! This is what I wanted from Costco! Oh my god, I can't believe she actually got me this. I was just telling her randomly I wanted this from Costco. Okay guys, we have an advent calendar for, for Vlogmas. I don't know if I'm going to do Vlogmas this year, but I'm going to be opening it every day. I don't know if on TikTok, but on this channel. Okay guys, this is the advent calendar with the, like the best chocolates ever. Like the bear, the bunny. Oh, This is the best advent calendar. And I'm pretty sure you guys should probably try to get this earlier because they always sell it before December even comes, so... Yay, my dream Evan calendar. Okay, last one. See, everybody in my comments, tell my mom she wrapped it really good. This is so cute. Okay, this is my favorite one she wrapped. It's so adorable. <laughs> I wonder where she got all this wrapping. Ta-da. <laughs> Another one. <laughs> Guys, she actually got me everything I wanted from Costco. Oh my god, gee, I love these so much. I've been telling her for like the past five years, I want this from Costco. Uh, like, this is one of the best gifts ever. I'm most excited for the advent calendar because I get to do it with you guys. So, yeah, make sure you guys, I might do this on TikTok or Instagram. Because it's like every day and like my vlogs only come out like once a week. So, yay, okay, thank you to my mom. I love my gift. And thank you to my auntie and my cousin. They gave me my beautiful necklace and earring. Let's see. I love silver jewelry. I can't wait to wear this. And guys, I'm I love the box for this. Oh, that's so cool. I always wanted one like this. It's so cool. And also shout out to my other auntie and uncle. They paid for our dinner at Hot Pot. I'm really thankful. I have such awesome family I get to celebrate with so yeah you guys will definitely see me wear this eat this and do advent calendar i got a package while i was at the restaurant so i thought i should open as well let's end the vlog with the amazon unboxing <laughs> okay they wrapped it they double wrapped it okay Okay, this is my Halloween costume and Mochi's Halloween costume. But yeah, our costumes are pink. That's a clue. I don't think I, you guys can tell what it is. Okay, I got new toothbrushes. So I got I got pastel toothbrushes. I got a pastel green, pastel blue, pastel pink, and beige. Actually, Mochi needs to replace her toothbrush too, so 
I'm gonna do hers blue and mine's pink. I used to brush Mochi's teeth every day, but that was so much work. And so now we only brush her teeth once every other day. Ooh, I got the soft one because I heard it's better for your gums. Look at the shape of this brush, it's so cute. Yeah, the pink one's for me and the blue one's for Mochi. Ta da, me and Mochi. I got a new camera for my door. I got a new ring, so I'll have to figure this one out. This one's cool though, because you don't have to screw it in. I'll link it down below if you guys want one that you could just attach to your door. Finally, which is also my Halloween costume. Yeah, that's it. know the last time I checked out with the vlog but I have the ghost pepper burger I really like the ghost pepper fries chicken fries they were pretty good barbecue sauce is okay with it but this there's actually a kick of spice so if you guys love spicy food I think you will love this I feel like I like the Spider-Man burger I had a while back more. I wouldn't get again, but I will get the Spider-Man one again, but they don't they're probably never gonna make it ever again. <laughs> Why my baby crying? My baby's crying. <laughs> no, you can't cry, baby. You just ate dinner. I literally just gave her a whole bowl of ki kibble and a bone, and she's she should be full right now. So she's oh, crying in the background. Just ignore that. We were trying to like recreate snack wrap at home. Packages. So it's a black spider web pumpkins, and he wants to add like red. Free sample this at Sam's Club and it was so delicious. I'm so confused because I don't like, I don't really crave kiwi nor really gravitate, but I was sold. And look at the box that we got. It's perfect. What the heck? They all fit here. I wanted to show you how satisfying it is that all six of them fit perfectly into this box. What's up, man? Check out check. Hey guys, this is our Halloween costume. What are you doing? Can I show you my oh, look at this two angel. Today is October 31st, Halloween day, Halloween night. 
They go and chuck a tree. Okay. Oh, I took you guys far away. Okay, we just finished chicken tree, guys. Look what they gave us. Hey! Oh my gosh! Hey, we only went to like ten houses. Look what they got. Why not this, this girl tried to advertise her business on the candy. I just ordered Mochi's cake at Walmart and now I'm looking at the holiday section. It's so cute guys. It's like little cups on top. It's so cute. They even have edible glitter. It's like 10 bucks each. Looking for the Hello Kitty card, but I saw this Avengers one. Oh, Captain America, Hulk, and Iron Man. Oh my god. I can't find the Hello Kitty one, so I thought she would probably like this one. I came home and I was so hungry, so I made hot cheeto salad. And this is a zero coke, so good. And yeah, I actually bought a lot of stuff, so I'll do a haul after I eat. I'm too hungry to do a haul right now. I ate my breakfast. It was so good. I did a recipe on. I did a recipe on my shorts, so go watch my shorts. Okay, first place. Every time I go out shopping, I end up going to like five stores. So I went to Aldi and I spent fifteen dollars. For a dollar eighteen, buy the lines for two forty five. Kielbasa for two eighty nine. Two cucumbers and I ate one just now. A dollar ninety cents and I love ground beef from all. This one's a hundred percent grass fed. Five dollars and ninety nine cents and then I got. I already ate the cilantro, but yes, I got cilantro for eighty five cents. I went to Walmart. I always get corn at Walmart. I love making corn cheese, Korean corn cheese. We were running out of soap. Also got milk. We are also running out of clothes detergent. Oh, at Walmart, I also got Coke Zero. If you have a Christmas design going on, I went to the mall for Forever 21, and they have a five below in there, so. Well, I got this weighted pillow. It's so cute. If you guys don't know by now, I'm doing a pink Christmas, but I'm doing it on my main channel, but I wanted to show you one of the first things I got. This was $5, and I really like it because it's heavy, so it won't like slip and slide all over my couch, which I'm planning to put it on my couch. Hello Kitty Christmas wrap. I wish it was pink or red, but this is like a like a weird purple, but whatever, it's cute and I think I need some. I used to never go shopping, guys, but now at this house, I'm always shopping a lot, which is a good thing because it's good for the economy. I noticed if you want like seasonal items, you have to buy it right when you see it because once it's gone, it's like gone. Like I said, I went to the mall for first forever to one because, guys, they have Hello Kitty gift bags at Forever 21 and it comes in a set of two. It was $9.76. It's a pretty good deal, like $5 each. We actually really need this in my house, guys. We've been throwing like our winter coats everywhere on the floor, so I got 
Bon Scarret. And there was only three left. Yeah, I see this lilac color. I love when Ikea has pastel items. So yeah, like a couple months ago, this was like sold out, but they kind of restocked it. So yeah, there was like three left and I got this. And yeah, you guys will see this. I don't know if I'll do it on this channel or the main channel, but stay tuned. But now we gotta go pick up my mom at her jobs. What do you think, Mochi? <laughs> Anime is so funny. He's like hiding right there. This new cherry blossom toy, this hamburger squeaky, <coughs> this candle for her birthday, and this banner for her birthday. And this beautiful birthday dress fits her perfectly. This is the state of our living room. I have definitely need to clean the nasty couch. I need to clean the carpet, vacuum, mop this house. So let's begin. C'est pas difficile à casser. Je dessine mes rêves sur les murs. I bought bulk tissue for my tissue box. They're really affordable when you buy in bulk. For the coffee table, I'm just gonna put this pumpkin and my tissue box. I'm gonna fill it up. Okay, I took a little break to eat dinner but everything looks so fresh and clean oh my gosh i need to sweep the floor mop and then do some tlc on this kitchen one of my neighbors was moving out they gave us a snow shovel so shout out to them i'm ready to sweep and mop the floor which i haven't done since i first moved in so yeah Okay guys, I finished sweeping. I hate sweeping so much. I haven't used this since I moved in. But I do remember it was a good mop, so... The last thing I want to do for this video is clean my kitchen because that will just make this whole video more satisfied, so... clean the dining room is clean the living room is clean even the couch is clean it's amazing oh my gosh and the floor oh, it feels so clean sorry this video took so long but i hope you guys enjoyed it i have a feeling this video will be really long so it'll be perfect for you guys who love long cozy productive vlogs so yeah we're done i'll see you guys in the next video